hi in this session we'll be discussing of relations what is a relation so a relation is nothing but a relationship between the sets of information so if you have set a and if you have a set b and your relation is nothing but relationship between the information on set a and set b it is known as or it is nothing but a set of ordered pairs set of ordered pairs set of ordered pairs where usually or always the first element is from the first set the second element is from the second set when we call that as an ordered pair when you have a pair of elements when you have a pair of elements like this for example a and b and i'll say this is an ordered pair means always my first letter always from the set a always from the set a and my second element is always from set b which is nothing but an ordered so this is called an ordered pair so relation is nothing but relationship between the two sets of information and it is always the ordered pair so here if i take an example of a set of person and age so i have a person names so x y z and all i have ages corresponding to their persons which is ordered which is ordered okay so for example let us draw some sets so here this is my set a and this is my set b okay and this this set is this set is a person set what is this i'll call this as a person so i'll have all the names of the persons so i have x y and z these three are the name of the persons and i'll have the other set which is talks about the age which is the age so for this person and this is the age set and i'll have a set of ages so 12 15 and say 20 right so this is a set of persons and this is a set of ages so and i have a relation i have a relation so the x person is having 12 age and the person y is having 15 age the person z is having the age 20 so if i define a set which has the relation between these two is nothing but our relations we can define the relations in a set is nothing but you will be having an ordered pair and always the pair is ordered the first element always comes from the first set the second element always comes from the second set right and here always the first set the first element which we know we call as a domain which we call as domain so domain is nothing but when you have an ordered pair like this always the first letter or first element will comes from the first set which is known as a domain and the second letter or second element which will comes from the second set which is known as range so for my example this is my range and this is my domain my domain is the person my range is the ages now how i will write the ordered pairs here so how i will write the ordered pairs which is nothing but it is a set so relations is a set of ordered pairs and in this ordered pairs the first element should be from domain the second element should be from range so how i can write this yes for any set you will indicate with this open and closed bracket and the person x is from the set domain having a relation of having age 12 okay now the other person y the person name is y having the age 15 right and i have another person who is z having the age 20 is right so this is my relation this complete is this is my 
relation set which has a relay this is nothing but set of ordered pairs which is known as a relation and if you observe all the first elements x y and z are from the set domain and all the ages like 12 15 and 20 are from the set range right so this is how we can represent our relation